For most people, the first impression that you have of Haiti is the devastation of the 2010 earthquake. You're going to see the devastation of Hurricane Matthew in 2016. Most of those first impressions, you would think that these people are sad. They have absolutely no idea what to do, where to go, but you have to spend some time with the Haitians to fully understand what they're going through. You will notice quickly that these are very kind and compassionate people and witness a work ethic like no other. They find the positive in, in every single negative and we feel that they just need an opportunity. They need a little bit of help and that's why this is one of the countries that we help aid. We've taken courses to give non-medical eye exams to go into some of these villages where some of them have never seen eyeglasses before. They've had trouble seeing. They don't understand why their vision is blurry. And we give them very simple eye tests and eye exams to see if we could fit them for some eyeglasses. And all of that is, of course, free of charge. I met a gentleman by the name of Gordon Mendenhall while I was on assignment in Kenya, Africa, and he was offering non-medical eye exams free of charge, and I was fascinated with it. Uh, working with Gordon, we wanted to bring that program over to Haiti, and that's when I met the family of Jeanette and Marty Meyer. They wanted to simply help, they wanted to get involved. Uh, so if it wasn't for them, we would not be bringing the program to Haiti in the first place. We are in Wuska village. So Wuska village uh, is an orphanage. So we take care of uh, the children and we helping also the ladies who doesn't have support. So we give food out every week to them. Thank you very much to Four North for the eyeglass they send here. It's very important for the people who cannot afford to buy glasses here. A lot of people come right now at Druska village and we looking forward to see if people at the provinces can benefit the glasses too. We serviced over 200 individuals and fit them for eyeglasses. And I watch these people, how excited they are. If you can imagine not having a set of eyeglasses for most of your life, how scary that would be. Um, I've, I've serviced uh, some folks that were in their 70s, never having eyeglasses in their life, and there's uncertainties. You, you can't see the visuals. Again, that, that can be very scary in life. I just came here to see my, my cousin, and then she told me, yeah, but there's a program here. Just they, they bring, I mean, some solution to people who can't see, or with glasses, but some of them, they have like prescriptions, or they don't have money to buy glasses. And then when she told me that, I said, wow, but let me go there so I could um, have a consultation also. I, could, I couldn't read, but I could see sometimes far away or close, but I couldn't, I couldn't read. I didn't know if I had this, this problem. And then when I, when I met Mr. Matt, he told me exactly the problem that I have. And then he gave me glasses. I didn't know if I had this, this problem. So I think this program for me is a really good program.